We'll probably get back to the big one. I also bought some, uh, like, the space deal. Montana. Big sky oh, country. Shit. Here we go, okay. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Then you get Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. How? Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see.
Listen up. Three rules. Stick close. Keep your guns in your holster. He'll be in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, I mean, this is why I lose time. Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Nelson. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They'll respect a 9 millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet pressure. Behave. Are you fucking like Do this, we do it my way. Quietly. Calmly. You got it? Fine. Hudson on the door. Watch our backs. Don't let any of these people get in. Rookie? On me. And you? Just try not to do anything stupid. Relax, Sheriff. You're about to get your name in the paper. You'll be fine. Fuck you. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. Will be my that is why we started the project. Chain. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us. Take our guns. Take our freedom. Take our faith. Let me shoot us now, right? We will not let them. Sheriff, sure, come on. Hold on we will not let their greed. Or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff. Sure, there will be no more this. suffering. No, oh, fuck this. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are. The locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Hold on, do not touch that service. Hold on and don't stand down. Stand down. Everyone calm down. We knew this moment would come. We've prepared for it. And here comes this food. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold. Surprise. Rook, put the cuffs on him. Ooh. Fuck you. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. Let's go. Get the fuck out of here. Marshal. 
Marshall, take point. We're going right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. Snap back. I have weapon. Back up. Back up. Oh. Rookie, keep up. I am a federal yeah, marshal. Up. I'm ordering you to stand back. I'm a mute. Please. Fuck you. I need to know what's going on. Okay. Oh Everything is just fine here. I don't need to call anyone. Is somebody just post them saying all Praise be to you. Fuck you. Unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. Last it looks like this. has begun. We will take what we need. We will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. And these the harbingers of doom will see the truth.
don't sometimes you just do still. It doesn't work out for Yeah, that's stealth. Take that. Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. Fuck. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard and we're gonna take out the rest of these. Okay. Shh. Put it in there! Oh, fuck.
dummy, they have fucking air support. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. Do I have a car, God it? John is coming. Oh, it's about to be brave. You have a sidearm for a reason. Of course. You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're, we're all, all fucked. fucked. Main point. <sighs> Goddamn collapse. Before. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it for years, <laughs> waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. America. Fuck. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. Everyone knows me. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. Give me back my weapon. Let's see if we can unfuck this situation. Just fuck yourself over again.
Okay. I'm not gonna take. Yeah, just here. Yeah, right. Where am I? Oh, okay. I think change for one two one two. Come here, deputy. We need to talk. Okay, bye. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Nobody cares. Most folks, just take the gun from my safe. We need to secure this island if we're going to get your partners back. Be careful out there. Crawl. Where did I go? First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people who might just fight alongside you if you help them. That nobody cares about? Yeah, sure. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. Third, you can tackle resistance missions. This is there are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against, against this cult, and they could sure use Same your time. help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. This is what's going to happen. In those places, we'll give the resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any cult shit you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Don't you? I'll just kill him. Let's load out this, uh, grenade launcher that I think we need to do again. Okay. I just go out over there at this time. If I'm allowed to, that's after him. Take everything you can. <laughs> Can't keep an eye on the uh Just don't go out and punch people to their death. We still don't have a blade yet, right? Well, I don't get a blade in this game. Never mind. Do I have a uh... hey kid? Hey, fist? If you're ever feeling lost, you just keep an eye out for white icons on your map and compass. And they'll give you an idea of what to do next. Someone. Oh my god! Nice. Oh, 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 oh,
three guys in total. Hey, give me all your resources. Fuck you. That's how you do it. fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. You should have some good gear squirreled away. Okay. Uh, I have no map. I'm ready. What's that gotten? Power. Shot you down and you don't even And guess what? What are you going to do about it? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 
Holy shit. This weapon, if you're looking to make a bigger impression, you may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. So just grab them up. Get crafting. That guy is still down. I do not think that. Whoa. You're a godsend. I'm going after that cult twice as hard now. Hi. Oh, why do I have to hire you? Are you making up? I've got a bone to pick with that cult. Yeah, it's legal out of 100. Hey, deputy. You. Now that you're partnered up, the two you should head to the forest research station. Cult's been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn. The way can Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. Cover me! Cover me! Ah, I fucked it up. Ready for more? Nope. I can see you. If I die, I'm going out. What the fuck? One more penny down. Bullets. Ah, that's just lost. I know how this is going to end. Good job clearing out the research station. Peggy's won't be back after the ass whooping you just laid on him. While you're there, check around and see if any folks are left alive. Definitely left alive, I swear to God. Oh, I don't have glass in here. No. I can't crack shit. Shit, kid. I'm impressed. There's more fighting you than I thought. You got a real shot at setting up this resistance. Next step is clearing up the radio signal. My CB's on the fritz. I can't get a hold of anyone off this island. The radio tower near the south shore must be busted. You think you can take care of that for me? <sighs> Just give me my fucking weapons back already. Shit, you fucked up. Why not? Getting a better angle. This what one boo boo. Go ahead. Just a few bumps and bruises this time. Just something that is gonna happen, and you just means more certain that will do it. Fuck you. Hey, deputy! I'm getting a strong signal now. Use a good drink. 
Centers. Every one of us. You, me. <laughs> Even the father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Nope. Yeah! Yes. I am a sinner. Yes. I wish to be unburdened. Yes. I must be Redeemed. If you're watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed. You will confess your sins. And you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Fuck. John Seed's got your partner, Hudson. She's in a world of shit, kid. You gotta get going. Oh, shit. Where are my goddamn weapons? Are you saying that I just wiped out all 
off my fucking inventory for the chest. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna get my weapons back. I hit my life. I just deleted all of my weapons. I don't have my fucking grenade launcher. That's all I have. I only want that grenade launcher. What the actual fuck? Chamber stability critical. System stability critical. Power levels critical. System reboot required. <laughs> What is this place, Herc? What am I doing here? Look, man, okay, there ain't always a logical explanation of these things. Sometimes you just find yourself, like, in a space station with little to no context or backstory, and you just gotta fucking roll with it, man. So, less questions and more movement, Nicholas, because if you don't save us, we all gonna die. What? I swear to God, I'm gonna whoop your ass when I see you. <laughs> Good luck. What the fuck? What the? I mean... Oh man, dude, I am so happy to see you too. Now I know what you're thinking. Where's my junk? But as important as the answer is to that question, we got bigger fish to fry. Firstly, let me explain what's going on. You are now on Mars. Well, now, imagine my arms are outstretched to comfort you during said revelation. Why are you on Mars? To save the Earth, man. What from? An alien invasion. Yeah, that's right, man. An alien invasion, Nico. Now, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna be us who are doing the actual saving of Earth. It's gonna be mostly Anne. That Anne. The AI super being that Larry Parker would not stop talking about. You remember? Only problem is, man, these aliens took over the entire planet. They messed with her network, man, and she has come undone. And we need to get her back. So how do we return Anne to this beautiful, majestic, earth-saving butterfly she once was? By finding energy cores and using them to power up all the terminals in the network, man. It's a simple plan, don't worry. Gotta get moving, though, man. There's a couple energy core thingies over yonder, man. I'll show you how this works. We'll get Energy cores? Alien invasion? What the fuck, Kurt? I didn't ask for this. Look, I'm sorry, man, okay? But you're not the only person whose life has been turned upside down for far-fetched and highly suspect reasons, okay? I mean, look at me. If anyone's a victim here, it's me, the Herkster. Now, I don't want any part of this. I just want to go back to my family. No can do, amigo. We used that last bit of juice to get you up here. Besides, if you don't power up Ant's terminals, you won't have a family to go back to. Okay, in there. all the way to Mars to turn the power back on? Well, don't say it like that. Control center restored. It worked, see? Nick, this is Ann. Ann, meet my bro, Nick. Uh, hi? Nicholas Rye, you are Earth's last hope. 
And me too, right? An arachnid force millions of years in the making threatens your world. But with your help, I can stop them. Yeah, Herc filled me in on that part. We turn on the terminals and restore your power and stop the alien invasion. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Why do you ask? I don't know. Just seems pretty simple for something not so simple. You'd think there'd be more to it. No. It is very straightforward. <clears throat> okay, man. All systems are a go. Let's get down to business. You're gonna need to be able to defend yourself out here. You see the green bales around here? Grab what's inside. Them. Now I know it just feels like space jizz or something. But this stuff is mad. Harvest is straight from the air. There's all sorts of cool shit out here. And you gave me a fucking pig. When you're done, man, take some of your space jizz over that 3D printing machine over there and I'll show you a cool trick. Voila, amigo! Welcome to the place where all your wildest dreams come true. Current designs are limited. The more you restore me, the more blueprints I can retrieve from the database. See how that works, man? Space jizz equals firearms. Incredible. Yes. And the more my systems are restored, the more tools I can provide to obliterate any and all life forms who stand in our way. Uh, what do you mean, all life forms? Oh, you'll see when we get outside. We? Yeah, man, I ain't gonna let you hog all the glory for saving the world. It's your partnership. Now, come on. I got my head, dude. You got work to do. Bob's head, man. This is not happening. Get a grip, Nicholas, because your brain's about to go kablooey, man. My antenna are scattered across the landscape. Turning them on will help restore my functionality. Oh, shit. What was that? Relax, man. It's just Mars, you know? It's just Mars. Wait, 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 man. Stay off that dirt. Spacecraft, man! Shoot it! Shoot it, please! Don't drop me, man! I'm defenseless! What? We can't find the other energy cores unless we power the antenna! Fuck me! I gotta climb towers now? Look, man, some stuff ain't as advanced out here as it is in Montana, for which I apologize, okay? forgot to mention those space crabs. They live underground. That that one's on me, man. I'm, I'm so sorry. That's my bad. You're sorry? You want to tell me what that was all about? Man, ain't you ever seen Tremors? These space crab dudes, they tear through dirt the exact same way. I'm telling you, man. I hope you got a good look, man, because they're the invaders, okay? They're the ones we need to stop. Anne was telling me that they're going to use her technology to invade the Earth and turn all the humans into food. Isn't that crazy? Exactly. Humans will become nothing more than food to sustain the arachnid horde as it spreads through the galaxy. Are you sure? Because, uh, I mean, they don't look all that smart to me. Well, they are. These little bastards, they've been... It's working! Okay, Antenna play. restored. Functionality increased. Excellent, Nick. Thank you for your assistance. You may now consult your map to locate other energy cores in this area. Oh man, those two blips right there? That looks like the spot where I was attacked by a big-ass space crab. I am picking up a signal from your gravity belt nearby. It will improve mobility, remove fall damage, and allow you to reach the transference center. No. No way, my space jets are still working, dude! Dude, my space jets are still working! Okay, let's go find them, man. Once you acquire the gravity belt, go to the transference center. What the hell is transference? <laughs> 
<laughs> Jumps off. Oh, fuck. Oh man, those two blips right there? That looks like the spot where I was attacked by a big ass spacecraft. I am picking up a signal from your gravity belt nearby. It will improve mobility, remove fall damage, and allow you to reach the transference center. No. No way, my space jets are still working, dude! Dude, my space jets are still working! Okay, let's go find them, man. Once you acquire the gravity belt, go to the transference center. What the hell's transference? Transference is the future. It's plugging my consciousness into a robot killing machine like I'm at 209. Transference is the future. Yeah, yeah, we get it, Anne. Oh, man, she's been trying to make me forget about finding my human body, so I'll just live life in a robot body. But I got a good feeling, man. I'm staying positive. Disengaging door lock. Please wait. Oh, dang, is that... Is that my hand? Well, who else's hand would it be, dummy? Fair point, man. I'm just not mentally prepared to accept the possibility that something really bad has happened to my childless dad bod. My scans indicate several more organic anomalies. Oh, come on, are you serious? My body's in a bunch of pieces? Oh, man, how are we gonna find them all? With transference, you will gain the ability to detect such anomalies yourself. Done and done. Here and now, another promise is made. We will find my body parts and put me back together like Humpty Dumpty, because there ain't no point in saving a world that does not include my beautiful booty. I'm happy you will comply. Transference is the future. OK, just like Anne said, we need to find the space jets I was using. Can't get to the transference center without them. Watch your step, man, and remember, the sand is bad. Damn! Looks like the energy cores are up there. We need to find those space jets. Oh shit, that's my pelvic area! Big ass space crab did me dirt! my junk. Nick. Nick, where's my junk? Nick, you are lucky you've never had to go through this, man. Nick, I'm telling you, there is no worse feeling than thinking you found your dismembered member only to realize it's your peckerless pelvis. Come on, man. No sympathy. Find the rest of me, Nick. From my temples to my taint to my toes, man. All of me, okay? And then Nick can turn me into a real boy. Hurt. What you're saying is impossible. No way, Jose. You shoot a big enough load of that space jizz in the end of the printer and it's Nonsense, Herc. With transference, you'll become something greater than man. You will become immortal. Indestructible. You will be. While there is truth to that statement, I gotta be honest with you, I am on the temporary train for this one, man. I don't expect you to understand the joys of humanity, the pleasures of the flesh, the delights of the senses, the takings of a monstrous dump. Approaching transference center. Oh, man. I'm starting to get real excited now. I cannot believe that in just a few minutes, I'm gonna be a cold, uncaring, cybernetic death monster. It's gonna be sweet, man. It's gonna be sweet. Okay, the 
terminal is on the top floor. You gotta power that place up before we can use the transference chamber. Fly like the wind now, little monkey. Not with that attitude, they don't. Use the transference chamber. The two of you working as a team will greatly increase our chances of success. Team Tad Bros for life! Put me in, dude! Put me in! Forget to take my head. We'll need it to complete the awkward human puzzle I've become. Hey guys. Channel now. Don't mess up my goatee. Yourself, you're about to pop a bro boner here. Check it out. Your bad boy Robocop here is fitted with a whole punch of lasers that these spacecraft don't stand no chance against. And this sexy, delicious rock hard body was built to last all kinds of physical and verbal abuse. We're linked up, man, so you can just tell me where to go and I'll follow, man. I won't even argue like ever. Unless you say something about monkeys. And if we find ourselves in a pickle and shit gets real intense, you just use me, man. I'll draw these suckers away with my jaw-dropping dance moves and such. 
Now, I know you're impressed with how impressive I've become, but don't let how impressive I am distract you from the fact that we gotta give our human compadres the heroes they deserve. We need to find more energy cores, man. I think there's another antenna nearby, so let's go. Huh? How the hell did you get mixed up in all this? Man, that's not important. What is important is that you understand how much danger we're all in because I didn't, okay? I fucked up. I, I didn't really realize. I tried to impress Anne by taking care of this all myself and where to get me? Got my damn body snatched and sprinkled all over damn Mars. It's probably my fault for telling her that I was Earth's greatest champion. I see that now, but come on, man. I was, I was trying to get something. So all I'm trying to tell you, Nick, is that you can't be a dummy about this, okay? You can't be thinking you're some new hot kid on the block. You gotta stay humble, man. Stay focused. You gotta be smart, man, like old Herky. Do you hear yourself? I'm stuck doing this because you're not smart. You're actually really, really dumb, Herky. I was dumb, man. I was dumb. Past tense. And for like a very short period of time, I'm talking 17 seconds max. And that's way less time than most people spend being dumb, which is a scientific fact. Which means that... You ain't no it's scientifically scientist. impossible for me to do anything dumb for like a long, long time, man. Like statistically, that's a fact. You're always right? Dumb. Right? Right? Nick? All right, man, same deal as last time. Get to the top and power that terminal. Hey, this looks kind of fun. It looks kind of deadly to me. Oh, just embrace it, man. See, there's a chance to test yourself. Those space jets, come on, man. Beware the stabilizer cores. Touching them will cause severe harm to any organic matter. Sucks for you, buddy, that you're made out of all that organicness. Too bad you don't have a sweet killer robot outfit like I do. Transference is the future. Robots never age, never decay, never rot. Robots are forever. Do you desire transference, Negrai? Uh, no. It's okay, I'm good. Acquired. So what exactly is going to happen once Anne's power is restored? As you restore power to my terminals, you will in turn help me regain control of my network. My robot army will power back on and assist you in fending off the arachnid horde. Wait, robot army? Once I 
regain full control, I will direct my robots to the launcher, where they will travel to Earth and intercept the arachnid invasion. Jesus. I know, man. It's gonna be awesome. Her. That sounds terrifying. Whoa, okay, hang on, man. I got all kinds of shit flashing up in my eyes here. What the hell is this? I've uploaded the locations of your body parts to your map. Ever wanted to blaze with a laser? Well, this here is the dang laser blazer. He punches it. Antenna C1 restored. Energy core locations updated. Okay, I should have done that Sweet! I'm picking up a reading now. Near that energy core. Let's check it out, man. No stone left unturned, know what I mean? I gotta say, Ann, I'm touched. Because I know you're not super on board with the idea of me being human again. I have had enough discussions with you, Herc, to know that appealing to you with logic and reason is pointless. Oh, man. That is really nice of you to say. You really get me. Herc, shouldn't we be focusing on saving the world? Nick Rye is correct. We are. I just want to take a peek, okay? Approaching mining station C1. Use caution. I am detecting a strong arachnid presence. A queen has laid her eggs here. Queen? Eggs? Remember what I said, amigo? Queen's gonna have that energy core with her, and we need to get it back. Killing her offspring will draw the queen out. Offspring? You mean, you mean babies, right? I don't want to kill babies. These ain't babies, okay? They're tiny little monsters, man. This is 100% guilt-free baby killing, man. Like baby carrots reveal. Besides, the only way we can draw the queen out and get the energy core. Shit online. Oh man, it was a funny 
picture, though. My mama, her face was so red, and it just looked like she was so focused. What the? My body part's on the move. Is it inside the queen? Oh, come on now.
so tough now, are you? Oh, yeah. You were right, Herc. She had your right arm. Uh, wait, what's this other thing? Exposing it to the arachnids will render them hostile toward one another. So I throw this thing out, and the space crabs fight each other, and not me. Fighting over a woman's heart. Maybe we ain't so different after all. Herc, these things want to eat every person on Earth. The universe works in mysterious ways, Nicholas. Terminal room lock disengaged. You may now enter. from our goal. Man, I don't know how much more of this I can take. You can, and you will, Nick. There will be danger at every turn, but I will be there to guide you. Hello, and me. I'm now capable of updating your map with all antenna locations. Okay. Restoring them should be your first course of action when entering a new area. Go now, Nick. Free me from these wretched creatures. I believe in you. I'm right here! You will save the Earth. Oh, good idea! Okay, whatever! I'll just be the accessory, the ultimate killing machine, an accessory! Super good idea there. You heard the lady. Let's go, Mr. Soul Hero of Earth, who don't need my help whatsoever. Of course not. The world's our orchestra, man. You just lead the way, and I guess I'll just follow along like a little toady helper boy. Er, would you grow up? Sorry, man. I'm just normally okay with being ignored by overly hot women. Just not when it's because of my best friend. Center. So much for this place. See, Nick, we really do have to make me human again, because if I die as a robot, we can't bring me back to life no more. Well, the same damn thing applies to humans, huh? Yeah, for now, but in the future, who knows? Uh, nothing happened. The center's power nodes require repairs. A bot has been deployed. Ball the repair bot! Cannot engage in combat and conduct repairs at the same time. We got your back, little fella. Repair bots on the move. things makes me nervous. It's, it's probably why I never collected anything of value or bothered any children. Look out, man, there's more of them. One node remaining. I'm feeling 
real sense of responsibility for these little robot fellas. I mean, they're like my people now. Repair center restored. Nice job, man. Game ball goes to repair, Bob, but that was a team effort all around. I fully recognize that. Okay, on to the next one. What the fuck? Warning. Geothermal anomaly detected. Whoa, hang on. Pump the brakes. That gassy thing is not friendly, man. Oh, man, these fumes, they fuck with your brain. Yeah, but I, I've been down that road before and I learned my lesson and I'm not doing it again. <laughs> Just saying. You've been warned. Oh, man, you got balls, Nicholas. I used to, too. Yeah, they're bald. Okay, back to Far Cry 5. The main game. No, no, not this again. How many what times do I gotta fuck? tell you to leave me and mine alone?
Peggy's in the world. Stop! This is fucked up! You have got to destroy it, man! You're having a goddamn nightmare, okay? You gotta end it! Peggy's are at the house! We're at the jail! Jim, man! How's she looking? Shut up, huh? Just a question, man. Jeez! Jim! Jim, stay inside! Well, I got these sons of bitches! I won't let them hurt you! Make long jumps. <laughs> no, no, not this again. How many times do I got to tell you to leave me and mine alone? So cruel. 
I think it's time you end that nightmare, dude. What the fuck? Looking crabby. Alistair Crowley stuff. Yeah. It got real weird backstage, man. Lots of orgies and whatnot. I mean, orgies seem real cool on paper, but you know what they never tell you about, Nicholas? The smell. They, they smell terrible. Sweaty leather clad bodies just rolling around. I mean, it smells like armpits and Bedusi. Fucking disgusting, man, but, but they rock real hard.
two cans of raid. Nicholas! Nicholas, please, man! My robot body is dying! Bro, I'm so impressive. I tell you, you see anything, man? Cause one of my bits is close by. because it's pretty underdeveloped. Approaching antenna B2. Oh, shit. Good luck with that one, dude. I do not know how you're gonna get up there. It will require a certain proficiency with the gravity belt. You said it, Ann. Oh my goodness, she is so smart and sexy. Uh, how can you know that? Man, I just know these things, okay? I've heard enough phone operators in my life that I can just tell when the looks match the voice. I just wish Anne's name was Gina. Boy, I got such a thing for Gina's. Gina Davis and Earth Girls are easy. Gina Gershon and Showgirls are my all-time fave. Gina Carano, man, whooping ass all up and down that octagon. But I'll tell you, man, it's important. It's important to have a sexy name, but I have learned that I can't have everything I want in a woman. And Anne really is special, so I'm telling you, what I'm, what I'm feeling for her, it might be... It might be the L word. You don't believe in love. Hey, someday I might.
core locations updated. Strange, I know, but sometimes it reminds me of my old man. Cause she's cold and has a general lack of interest for my well-being, just like he does, and it drives me wild. Center. Oh, this is cool, man. We get to see where Anne makes her babies. Terminal malfunction. Deployed. Robots hostile. Oh man, I gotta learn how to buy my time. Pairbot using the console. The hell do we do? Hit the console again? I mean, it can't happen twice, can it? Famous last words. Oh, man! You see? I'm gonna take you gambling, Nicholas. Whoa, never mind. Solo gambling it is. Your bad luck, dude. Protect the repair bot. Nick, what's that repair bot? Bad robots, okay? You can tell the difference, right? They're the ones that look kind of mysterious.
prepared. The robot creation center can now be powered on. Robot Creation Center restored. And robots sure are a force to be reckoned with, dang. Yeah, well, it's pretty fucking terrifying how easily they can start attacking us. Malfunctions, Nicholas. These things happen, okay, man? Don't worry about it, okay? Anne's gonna have it all under control for the big dance. They ain't gonna hurt us. Yeah, well, color me skeptical. <laughs> Some bowls. Whoa, man, this is trippy. I'm at that son of a bitch John Seed's ranch. It's all weird looking though. Man, it sounds like these fumes hijack your brain compartments and pick at your emotions. You mean like how I wish to God I could have watched him die real slow? I could kill that guy a hundred times and it still wouldn't be enough. I hear him! Ha! Die, asshole! Oh man, that felt good! Just changed. Well, was it Sharky video game all about Thank that? God. New gun every five kills or something? I ain't complaining. To hell with this guy. There you are, you sick motherfucker. Oh, what the? There's more. There's more John C. <laughs> well, oh, careful what you wish for, amigo. John Seed. I'm worried about you, Nicholas. Shot. You need to work out, man. Oh, yes, yes. Man, this is intense. What's intense is getting chubby from killing the same dude over and over again. You know what else is intense? Camping. You're in a world of hurt, pal. Would you quit dicking around in there? Oh, oh, what the fuck? No. <laughs> Get him. Oh my god. That's the best oh. weapon. Yeah. I love this weapon. Not hugger. The nut hugger. The nut hugger. <laughs> this is a.
Hello? Anyone left? Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. You feel better now that your virtual reality cleaned the place out? Yes. Yes, I do. All right, <laughs> then. Good boy. Come on back now. Smash dog. It's ass. Somebody woke up on the wrong side of the bed this morning. Oh, well, definitely. Sex appeal in the air and jealousy. One of my body parts must be nearby. That's what that means. Arachnid Research Center. Warning. This center has been overrun. I am detecting a large arachnid presence and many nests. Uh, looks like these here space crabs are a little pissed off at all your experiments, Anne. Gotta be a queen here. Let's get after it.
detected. Uh-oh! Holy shit, man, there's three of them! Are you nuts? We can't fight three at the same time. Dude, this is so scary. Like, worse than having to zip your pants up when you're drunk. Evasive maneuvers, Migo! Come on, man, we gotta tag team them.
man. I thought we were goners there. My scans indicate that the queen population has considerably decreased in size. I'm impressed, Nick. Dude, the terminal? Power it up! Hang up, I guess I'm... Let's 